YouTube. This is um, Tyler. Um, this is really my second video on YouTube of uh, I've hired a uh, Lego snowplow video. You see it. Well, uh, here's another thing: is a bobcat. I uh, just got a couple weeks, couple of days ago. S185 bobcat. It's really detailed, especially inside the cab. It's got that little bar thingy that goes up and down the safety bar. Um, it's got a dozer blade. It's got hydraulics that turn left and right. I had to pinch the hydraulic covers because they were loose and it would stay. It would it would just like move all around. But it goes left and right. I the bobcat thing. It goes up much easier with this kind with all this stuff. I don't like the things that go down straight down. I'm not really a fan of those. I love them kind, but I'm not really a fan of how they go up. They go up pretty hard. Like, not these kind of bars, but when the bars come, like, from right here, they go straight down. Not really a fan of how those go up, but I love those kind. I have them with tracks. Not really a fan of that kind when they go up, but they're good bobcats. They're very rare now. All the new kinds have all this stuff. That, this and all that stuff. Well, I got a couple attachments for it, which is the dozer blade. It goes left and right. It comes off. And another attachment that I have for it is a bucket. I got the bucket with it. It just clips right on. It stays on, actually doesn't slide off like the older models. Bring it up. Tilt the bucket. And I got one very cool attachment for it. It's actually a broom. It's got like toothbrush bristles. It spins. See? It's got springs. So it bounces. If it goes over like a bump. And you put it on the bobcat. Just clip it on. And if it goes over a bump or something, it bounces. It turns left and right. You put it down with, like on the bobcat, and you can brush like the sidewalks or something. You can use it for dirt or a light brushing of snow or leaves. I'll have another video of it with the snow, with the blade, the dozer blade in the bucket and the dirt, and the dozer blade in the snow. I'm not gonna really use the br broom because I don't want to wreck the um, the bris the broom part, the bristles, because they're very delicate. Well, not really delicate, but I don't want to anything get stuck on them and then bring them in the house and get have my mom yell at me for getting dirt all over the house, so. It turns. And I got a little trailer that I put it on. It's got elastics to, like, tighten everything down. And I can take these ramps off. I made a hitch for my dually pickup truck. It, it this thing, I have a big, like, labrier crane, however you say it, and I had these little things that would stand up here for like, um, a truck that would, um, would, uh, escort it, escorting truck, and this would have to hold it, this box, I'll have to take it out, but it, it also hauls a big F1, it also, um, it also hauls a, um, a, uh, fifth wheel trailer, it's pretty long, it's got, as you can see, it's got the dually tires. And I put my own hook on it. I got this little set thing in a bag. And I put a little screw on it. And I put the trailer hitch on it. And then I just haul all my stuff with it. See, like that. And the bobcat, I just put on it with the attachment. Review of it of them in the dirt and the snow, but uh, please rate, comment, and please rate, comment, and subscribe. Uh, Tyler signing out.